you, Monday. We've got someone's joining the the work today because she's off to Morrison's to do the the weekly shop. Oh, it's okay. Okay. We have quite a busy week ahead of us. I'm going to be doing some rehab stuff. So my good friend Shane Flowers sent up these cuffs, these uh, blood flow restriction cuffs. Yeah, going to do a bit of that stuff today. What else have we got on today? Cleaning the garage, so we'll take you up to the garage, guys. We've got a plan for the garage, so we've got a little set up there at the moment, but I need to clean it out. I think Big Tom's wanting to get the stones, the heavy stones, moved through to the warehouse as well. So I think that'll be today, but yeah, just come along with us for the journey. Bye, guys. See you soon. The Divine Warrior. <laughs> Pretty much everything on those shelves have already been bought by lovely people, you know. The biggest order fr from anything coming, uh, hopefully in the next kind of month and a half. This room, the back room, your office. We're going to have to use your office as well. <laughs> <laughs> it's just uh, making sure you get everything right, isn't it? Right guys, so up at my house, we're gonna show you what we've got. So in the garage, this is where we used to train. So excuse the mess just now. So this is the next few days job anyway, is to clear out all this. Hot tub from the ice bath company and a cold tub. So this is set at, so that's 40 degrees and the cold tub is set at two degrees. So we've got another couple of bits and pieces coming. All this stuff is going. There's actually, this box up here actually, we'll take that out one day. That's actually full of old t-shirts from Scotland Strongest Man. So maybe one day we could take them out. Anyway, that's today's job. We've got to go over to our dad's house. We're going to do a photo shoot with the trophies, eh? I've never been this way, eh? Got to out the stones for me to get them out. So dad's got a wall around his Dad went red, red you one day, eh? He just got so annoyed at me that I was teasing him so much, right? He went and headbutted the, the old wall between his and Luke's house. And geez, look what happened. As they say in Poland, cold. So this is gonna. This is a, obviously a hole that's, in the. That's Dad's toilet there as well. Jeez, I'm staying away from that. That's a disaster. So yeah. So that's your house. So that's our house, and that's Dad's house there. Um, so yeah, the thought is to make like a, a gate to go through into this bit of land. So we used to call the land that Kush and I have our house in the Secret Garden when we were younger. We used to go and play there and stuff, but we've got to go and get the more. Not the more, we've got to go and get Tom's trophy. We're going to be getting some robot mowers as well, just like, so Dad's got a wee robot mower. We've got veg that we're going to plant soon that we'll show you as well. This is beautiful. I don't know if anyone's watched the video when we bought Dad a truck. That's a new one. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. This is uh, Falk, there's Harry, there's me, Opa, that's Dad. That's why we've got a big table. It's so long. <laughs> you know, any other table wouldn't uh, hold his weight. <laughs> this one's so much heavier. Mental. Look at this, but now this compared to me, it might be. That's my other bicep gone. Ben, I want your house. I would love to live here. 1.5 million. So I don't know if anyone remembers, but this bed here, so Dad's just dug it all up. So Dad will plant sunflowers. Mum's favourite flower was the sunflowers, so it's like a tribute to, to Mum. But I think he plants like seven or 8,000 sunflowers here. So hopefully when we come back in a couple of months or so, I'll just be a mass of sunflowers here. So that'd be quite nice. But he's done it all by hand. He had a spade and he was just digging it all over by hand. I could go back down and do some rehab stuff for my bicep. So I'm going to do that now. Right, so I've got a little compression cuff. So now I'm going to hold in this position. So I can feel a little bit in the tendon. So in a minute now, it's at 60%.
Does that hurt? No, it doesn't hurt. It's just like a blood pressure monitor. You know when you put a blood pressure monitor and it goes tight. This is probably what I'll do every day. Just start in the morning or come in the morning and do this. Not the most exciting, but it's part of the rehab process. Sure. Can you get us on YouTube, right? No, no, no. I would, drop kick a, I would drop kick a child for a Diet Coke. Jesus. I will. I have. Oh, you're going to have to get out of here. What? Of course. Uh, two, nine. 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 Oh, no, oh, it's fine. That's fine. Don't oh, no. It's, it's just fine. a. Right. Hey, no, it's fine. Don't, don't get you. See, this doesn't come off. It will. Oh. 15 grand, that's eh? coming off. 15 grand. <laughs> oh, that's actually scratched, eh? It's not scratch, scratch. It's just a little. It's all right with me. Sure, you don't have a knife in you. You're lucky it's me here. I'm cool, calm, and breezy. <laughs> Training session. This is our little storeroom. As you can see, it's packed with my protein. So I'm going to go for the pre-workout shot today. Mm. Oh god! So we'll go down to the gym. I think Big Tom's training as well. So we'll see how the big chaps doing after the Rangers lost the cup final. So I'm not so happy. <laughs> So guys, as you can see, I'm back in my natural habitat. Sorry. Today, we were taking these bad boys through. A lot of people that have been coming to the gym have seen these settle outside our gym. The 250 kg at the stone, 265. Look at that, Tom. And real stones, eh? 265 kilogram stone. I'm excited to get that back up on the lap and back up on the platform where it belongs. I'm actually turning 30 on Thursday and I'm going away from Wednesday, which is basically tomorrow, all the way to next Wednesday. Sinead has surprised me for my 30th. We're gonna to go to a safari, see one of my favorite animals, giraffe. You're getting bullied. <laughs> um, it's the other thing about giraffe. Touring in London for a day, then we're going out to Leon as well, on holiday and watch Taylor Swift. <laughs> When I come back from holiday next week, myself and my helper and cameraman Tom will be good to go. One last thing I think a lot of people know, or some of you might not know, Ashley Kane is doing an Ultraman right now, which is running Land's End to John O'Groats, cycling back from John O'Groats to Land's End, then kayaking back from Land's End to John O'Groats. No rest days. I went up to John O'Groats to see him. Unbelievable turnout. He's not getting enough recognition as well, so go and give him a follow on Instagram. Go and see what he's doing, because he's doing it for his daughter, and what a story it is. Go see him. Big shout out to Ashley Kane. Keep smashing it. Let's go, champ. Anyway, guys, that was me done. You're not seeing much of me on YouTube. You won't see much of me for the next week, so I'm sorry. Here's my face for another five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Stay spicy. <laughs> Thank you.
I think that's what the Highlands, Highlands are all about, is being nice to each other, looking after each other, and, and I really hope that Tom and I can really try and promote that as much as we can. <laughs> So, we're in the hardware store. I'm wanting to make a frame, a throwing for a height frame. So need, it's got like seven meters. So that's six meters. Six. 40 mil coupling, which is that. So we need two of them. Something for this would be crucial, it'll be good fun. <laughs> oh, that's the makeshift frame components bot. See in about a month when it's finished. Our dad had or has bad sciatica and he bought it years ago. So it's basically an infrared sauna but it goes up your spine. So there's a heat panel where you sit down it goes up the base of your spine. So needless to say it's been sat doing absolutely nothing for the last however many years. So like we said earlier on in the video we need to clear this space out. So in the next video you'll see our new fancy thing that we're getting. Hopefully you enjoy that. We've got all the fireworks here for just, just for fun. Fireworks. Think I'll be alright, huh? Uh -uh. Oh, Kanaka Waka Nawa Nawa. Ah! <laughs> po po! <laughs> right. Smoke's been that way. <laughs> oh, nailed it. <laughs> well, that was a Usain Bolt, man. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. <laughs> it was an accident. <laughs> what are you saying? You're in trouble, I bet. I'm in trouble, Oh, fuck, this will be fun getting this up here. I know. How do we, uh, I think we'll just have to get it out and then just uh, ram it up, right? Yeah, yeah. No, I can get it. <laughs> nothing to see here, nothing to see here. <laughs> Dre to you. <laughs> oh, you're legend. Oh, that's much better, eh? 
Oh, I saw it go. Oh, no. <laughs> there we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's the base up going there. Oh, so. Oh, well. Yeah. We went to Blyswood first. Uh, <laughs> they were like, oh, yeah, no, we're not taking that. <laughs> <laughs> Right guys, so I've been invited down to Tesla in Glasgow for a very, very special reason and very spicy reason. You will soon find out. Come inside and everything will be unveiled. Oh, oh where am I? Wow, it's a cyber truck. Oh, that was high, Jesus. Right guys, so I've been invited down by Tesla to check out this beast, the Cybertruck. It looks like a transformer. I'm gonna have some fun with it. Gonna go inside, check out some gadgets. But man, the world's strongest man needs a, the world's strongest car, this Cybertruck. It's meant to be bulletproof. It looks unbelievable. So let's go. Ho oh, ho, this beauty, eh? This is fit for a king. Look at that, I fit in perfectly. Right guys, you know what we're gonna do? We're in Glasgow. We're going to take this to the Highlands, ready? Boom! Tesla went and tested this out. Someone chucked something at it and it wasn't bulletproof, but watch this. Oh my God. <laughs> well, that's the best feature of the car, about 100 miles. So, to raise this car up, and it, like I jumped out on that and it looked like I was fucking going to die. You put it onto off-road, you have all these cool things off-road. This is, means it's extract, means it's raised up. You can do it very high, high, to make you look like a pimp on the road. This, right, so this is a whoopee cushion. Tom! This is a steering wheel. My head's not hitting the roof. Look how much space I've got to the side. Oh, I didn't even hear, see the reason there's a gap. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> there's a gap. Man, this is unreal. You know, I'm very lucky to be able to even get into one of these. I've always wanted to see a Cybertruck. I've seen these in pictures before. When you see the whole car, when you're up that high in it as well, it looks unbelievable, but yeah. So guys, to open the bonnet, obviously you just press and look, right, this, and uh, you get, so uh, you get a bonnet in the Tesla, but this, this is a proper bonnet, right, let's go have a look at this. A bonnet fit enough for the king. We have got one more surprise to show you from the Tesla. You ready to see this? Let's check it out. So look what we're gonna do tonight. Let's schedule show. We are gonna do the arrival, which is the thing, right? So we're gonna do now, confirm, exit the vehicle to start the light show. <laughs> That is, well, that's awesome, man. Jeez. So unfortunately I can't take this home today, but I do have a ride to get back home. Let's do it. Tom, to the Highlands we go. Three, two, one.